What's up everyone? Today I was going to make a custom hydro flask. I ordered this hydro flask. I was going to do a custom uh, welded design on it. I was planning on stripping the paint off it, not a big deal. However, I realized it's double walled with a sealed vacuum inside of it, so I can't weld on it. <laughs> I found out the hard way once before trying to do this, so not a big deal though. I ordered the second one off Amazon as well. It's like a, uh, it's kind of like a knockoff hydro flask type deal. Uh, single wall stainless steel, so I will be able to weld on it. We're gonna do some welding artwork. We're gonna do some uh, paint, other types of artwork as well. We'll figure it out as we go. Stick with me though, this one's gonna be fun. Okay, now that I got it engraved, I got it clean and see everything really well behind the helmet when I put the helmet on. I think we're ready to go. So yeah, let's get suited up here, get ready to weld. Let's see how it goes. Whoop. Okay, so here we go. Turned out all right. I had to change a couple things on the fly because this thing was heating up like crazy, as expected probably. It's all good. We got some good weld on it. I'm gonna paint it now and we're gonna go from there and see what happens.
All right, everyone, there we go. I got it done. I definitely wish I could have had more welding on it. Unfortunately, just due to how thin this thing was, I was gonna do some serious damage to this thing if I started to weld anymore. So I'm happy I did get some weld on it. We used it as kind of like an extra effect to do a little layering effect on it. But overall, I'm pretty stoked on it. I really like the paint job. I think it turned out pretty cool. Unfortunately, uh, just because of welding on something so thin, the inside of the stainless isn't really usable anymore. So this one will just be for show. But anyways, this was a fun one. I hope you enjoyed it.